New 2017 Lexus LS Luxury Flagship Arrives at Detroit Motor Show All new Lexus 7 Series and S-Class Rival gets big redesign, new cabin, new engine, and new technology highlights. Lexus has taken the wraps off its all-new LS Flagship Saloon at the Detroit Motor Show. The new LS ushers in a completely overhauled look, using Lexus' latest design language including a huge spindle grille made up of over 5,000 surfaces. The fastback, four-door coupe shape takes clear influence from the 2015 LFFC coupe concept, the angular front end contrasting with the swooping side profile with broad shoulders over the rear wheels. It's also lower, 1,450 mm, longer, 5,235 mm, and wider, 1,900 mm, than the car it replaces, while its wheelbase has been stretched to 3,125 mm. The new design sits on top of a new platform, too. As expected, it gets an extended version of the new GAL architecture underpinning the new LC Coupe. It's a lighter, stiffer platform, and combined with weight savings from new lightweight materials such as ultra-high tensile steel and aluminium, the new LS is 90 kg lighter than the older model, despite being a larger car. The new platform ought to be beneficial when it comes to how the car feels to drive on the road, as it places far more mass from the engine, plus the passengers, into a lower and more central position in the chassis. Making its debut in LS 500 form, it gets a new twin-turbocharged 3.5-liter V6 engine with 409 bhp and 600 nm torque. That means more power and torque than you'll find in the outgoing V8-powered LS460, and while we've no fuel economy figures it should be more efficient. We've no top speed, but the new LS with its turbocharged V6 engine can do 0 to 62 miles per hour in 4.5 seconds in all-wheel drive form. It'll be available as a rear-wheel drive car too, and uses a 10-speed automatic gearbox. New multi-link suspension front and rear is also present, making extensive use of aluminium to save weight. Lexus says the new system should introduce a more precise steering response. It's mated to a new generation vehicle dynamics management setup for optimized ride comfort and traction, and rear-wheel steering is also a part of the package, for greater stability and agility. Complementing the revolution both on the surface and under the skin is a new cabin packed with equipment and technology and design tweaks. Ambient lighting inspired by Japanese lanterns greet passengers, and there's a new selection of wood finishes for the redesigned cabin. New 28-way adjustable front seats with cooling, heating, and massage functions will be offered, and place driver and passenger in front of a flat, horizontal dashboard teeming with displays a 12.3 inch navigation screen being the centerpiece while a huge head-up display will be an option in the back optional rear seats with heating cooling and massage functions will be available while the rear seat luxury packages introduces rear seats that can recline up to 48 degrees new advanced safety features also make the cut as part of the Lexus safety system and suite including a pedestrian detection and avoidance system with active steering. Lexus co-drive also features, providing steering control up to whatever the driver requires and semi-autonomous capabilities on motorways. Regarding a release, Lexus has only said that the car will go on sale in the United States towards the end of 2017. We've yet to hear news of its UK release, or which engines to expect when it arrives in Britain.